There's a patient here to see you, sir. Well, go on, send him in. <laughs> Have a seat. What's your name? Your name, son. Katie, what's his name? His name is Charlie Cobblestone. Charlie Cobblestone, huh? What's his problem? He's afraid of noises. Afraid of noises? Ah. Well, let's see. I'm going to um, look through here. I believe that we've had a case like this. Ah, yes, here it is. Oh, that face, fateful Charleston case. Poor man. Everyone scared him so bad, you remember what he did? Ran right out of the office he and never came right back. right out of the office. That poor fellow. I'm afraid something might have happened to him. Never mind that. Ah, never mind that as well. Yes. Anyways, uh, would you cue up the buzzer sound, please? I'll start it from my computer here. we got to make sure we catch him off guard, so I'm going to... Well, don't be wincing. It's nothing bad. Strange. That's okay. It didn't work on our first patient. Um, ah, here's the one I wanted. Ah, yes. This is a 20... No, check that. A 22-step guide to overcoming your fear of noises. I have no clue who it's by. It's never been tested, but I hope you enjoy it. I'll see you back next week. Have a good day, my good man. I'm going out to lunch break. Eric will be here if you need him. All right, then. Sure. There's a second patient in this room, too. Second patient? Well, send him in. not put your feet on my desk. How about that? Now, um, see your name. <clears throat> Josephine and Davidson. Very nice. Let's put this into our system here. Um, how old are you? 18. 18, like the eight. one and then the eight. I don't know how to put this, but, um, you look young for your age. Well, you know how you get older, you kind of go no. That's... Okay. I don't even know where to go with that. So, we're just going to move on. Um, what's, what is your problem again? I'm sorry about that. I don't have an issue! Of course not. Say, hypothetically, that someone had split personality disorder, how would they know? You have no idea what I'm saying to you. Um, I'm afraid there's not a whole lot I can do to help you except for give you this. It's um, instructions that- Whoa, no, 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 no. These, this is very important scientific information. Okay, this will help you overcome your problem that you don't have. Can I trust you to take this? Home? Sure. Okay. <clears throat> ah, Katie, you're back. Uh, would you mind taking over for me so I can go eat some lunch? Sure. Go for it. Eric's still here. He'll be your assistant. I think we have another patient scheduled. Um, so... Alright. Got you in. Well, if you're not going to say it, you can type it in for me. Okay. Well, here's this. If it doesn't work by 
Monday calls.